Hello and welcome back to Law Firm Shepera's channel where we dive into the latest legal policies. Today we are exploring a hot topic, Serbia versus Portugal. Which residency should you pursue in 2024? Both of these beautiful European countries offer the right to work, study and live within their borders through the residency program. Some may prefer the coastal landscapes and seafood of Portugal, while others prefer continental vibe and Balkan cuisine in Serbia. But today we are not here to talk about tastes. We are setting the table with objective criteria to help you make an informed decision. First on the menu is a significant change in the Portugal's Golden Visa program. In a surprising move, the option for real estate investment is off the table. This is a big deal, folks, and it's still on the menu in Serbia. This change is a stark reminder the residency laws are changeable, highlighting the urgency to act swiftly to secure your residency. Yes, today's options might not greet you tomorrow, so speed is of the essence. To open the doors to Portugal now, you will need to shell out a hefty 500,000 euros in a research institution or a venture fund. While venture capital can offer impressive returns, complexities and uncertainties are not suited to all investors' needs and experiences. In Serbia, the same investment could translate into a portfolio of properties, each with the potential of rental income and appreciation. And here's the kicker, no minimum investment for snagging the real estate. That's freedom to invest at your pace. Serbia's flexible investment landscape stands out particularly because it doesn't dictate a minimum investment for real estate, allowing for strategic investments tailored to individual preferences and financial capabilities. This flexibility offers a more accessible and potentially rewarding pathway to residency and possibly citizenship, underscoring Serbia's appeal in the residency program arena. Option number two, considering a donation to Portugal's national heritage to 250,000 euros. It's noble, but with the same amount, Serbia invites you to own a piece of its charm. Now that's a tangible piece of heritage that you can live in. Option 3. Portugal beckons with the residency for innovative startups. Serbia, on the other hand, lays out a welcome mat to all entrepreneurs. No innovation label needed. If innovation isn't your game, Serbia plays a friendly match welcoming businesses of any industry for residency. And what about application processing fees? Serbia's playing the generous host. Processing fees range up to date from 5,000 to 8,000 euros in Portugal. While in Serbia that range is 50% less or even more depending on the service provider. Now let's talk citizenship. And if it's a sprint to citizenship you're after, Serbia's three years residency requirement dashes ahead of Portugal's five. Serbia requires just three years of residency to apply, while Portugal asks for five. It's a clear win for Serbia. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Portugal's golden visa stands out for its visa-free access to Schengen area a privilege that opens up to Europe in a way that Serbian residency currently doesn't. For those having passports requiring visas for Schengen, this can be pivotal. Question looms. Is the 500,000 euros investment in Portugal worth the border freedom? It's a significant decision that hinges on personal priorities and the value you place on mobility. On the other hand, the minimal stay requirements of Portugal's Golden Visa program are undeniably attractive. Just 7 days in the first year and 14 in the next one is all it asks. 
compared to Serbia's more stringent requirement not to be absent for more than 10 months within three years if aiming for permanent residency or citizenship. This flexibility makes Portugal an appealing option for those seeking to maintain global lifestyle without being tied down. So in the game of immigration laws, Serbia might not always outplay Portugal's football team. But when it comes to 2024 residency match, it's a serious contender. In the grand scheme, comparing Serbia and Portugal's residency options is less about scoring points in a game and more about aligning with your life's goals and aspirations. As we've seen, the preferences in lifestyle, investment capacity and mobility define the route that best suits you. And with the ever-evolving landscape of immigration laws, acting swiftly on these decisions has never been more crucial. Thank you for tuning in! If you find this comparison as engaging as we hope, smash that like button, share and subscribe. Got opinions or questions? Drop them in the comments below or email us at info at Until next time, stay informed and proactive!